What would be the final pressure if we opened a valve separating 3 liters of nitrogen at 1.8 atmospheres and 2 liters of hydrogen and 3.5 atmospheres? So if we open the valve, these two gases are going to mix and we're going to get a mixture of two gases. Each gas is going to have a partial pressure and in order to find the final pressure, what we need to do is we need to add these two pressures together. We cannot take the initial pressures 1.8 atmospheres and 3.5 atmospheres and add them together because in addition to changing the pressure that is going to happen we also have a change of the volume if we had a standard volume the same container and mixing gases together adding some more gases together there we can just add the pressures of the gases using the dalton's law of partial pressures which we cannot do here because the volume is also changing now, so how are we going to address this problem? In order to simplify it, we're going to separate this into two parts, or we're going to look at the gases separately. In the first part, we're going to look only at the nitrogen. So for a moment, we ignore about the hydrogen, and we think about what is going to happen if we open the valve. The nitrogen will start flowing to the second container and will now occupy a higher volume, bigger volume, and the volume is going to be 5 liters, 3 liters here and 2 here. Now, second, now we're going to consider for the hydrogen. If we open the valve here, the hydrogen will spread in this flask as well, and it will be in 5 liter container with a new pressure. These two pressures are going to be the partial pressure of each gas. So, partial pressure of the nitrogen in the new system, and here we're going to have the partial pressure of the hydrogen in new system which is 5 liters and we need to add them together but the question here is how do you find the partial pressure in the system so again for a moment if we ignore the hydrogen gas here and we think about the nitrogen gas once we once we open the container it will spread into the second container and the new volume is 5 liters so what we want to do is use the Boyle's law which shows the correlation between the pressure and the volume how is the pressure changing depending on the volume? We have the initial volume, we have the final volume, we have the initial pressure, and so what we want to do is find the final pressure, which we can calculate based on this formula, P1 V1 is equal to P2 V2. This is the Boyle's law, and here what we want to find is the P2, which will be the partial pressure of the nitrogen in the new system. So we can write down that the P2 is equal to P1 times V1 over V2. And so what we have is 1.8 ADMs, which is the initial pressure multiplied by 3 liters over the final volume of the system, which is 5 liters. So this is equal to 1.08 atmospheres. Now this is the partial pressure of the nitrogen in this new system when everything is mixed together. Now we know that the partial pressure of the nitrogen here is 1.08 atm and we can also think about this does this actually make sense so initially it is 1.8 atmospheres now it occupies a larger volume so the partial pressure of the nitrogen went down because the volume increased second we do the same for the nitrogen let's use the same formula Boyle's law and we're going to use the same expression here so p2 is equal to p1 times v1 over v2 and if we put the numbers we'll have 3.5 ADM multiplied by the initial volume of the hydrogen gas it was in this container it's 2 liters so we're going to put here 2 liters over the final volume which is the same system is the same 5 liters we cancel this so 1.4 ATM and this is the partial pressure of the hydrogen 1.40 atm which also went down and it went down significantly it went from 3.5 to 1.4 because the volume has changed significantly for the hydrogen it went from 2 liters to 5 liters and the partial pressure of both went down but in order to find the total pressure of course we need to add these two together now in this new system we need to use the Dalton's law which says that the total pressure is equal to the pressure 1 plus pressure 2 and so now we have for the nitrogen hydrogen we just simply add these two together 1.08 plus 1 1.4 2.48 atmospheres